It's hard to believe that I'm really here after all of the regionals in the U.S., after all of the really hard practices and coaching sessions, after having to redesign my whole approach to breaking for these competitions, I'm here. I don't know if I'm ready, but I'm here. Last time I did an international battle like this, it was Paris, and I had zero rounds. A couple of signatures here and there, but mostly freestyle. And now, now things are different. Did y'all sign up for a mukbang? Because I'm smacking. All right, that's not gonna age well. My goal is to make it out the prelims this time. That's it. That's my goal. We're gonna take this one round at a time. One battle at a time. Let's smash this prelim. We be the infamous, you heard of us, official Queenbridge murderers, the mom comes equipped for warfare, beware of my crime family who got enough shots to share for all those who want to profile and pose, rock you in your face, stab your brain with your nose bone. Alors, j'ai besoin de la vite from United States of America versus Pepsi from the United States of America. Must win two rounds. Round one. Fight. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Track, yeah. my track. Pepsi l'emporte, mesdames et messieurs. Une chaude main d'applaudissement pour la mix. I've been back for a minute. I just, I was tired. Traveling, it drains me. Traveling makes me tired. As far as the competition, my my one goal was to make it out the prelims. I had to, you know, 
I had to make my goal like a minimum goal so that I would wouldn't like pile too much expectations on myself and fumble and fold under like too much pressure that I didn't even have to deal with yet. So my goal was to make it out of the prelims. Once I made it out the prelims, it was just like I wanna rep my I wanna rep well, like I wanna do well, I wanna try this, I wanna try that, I wanna see um where I'm at, how I'm doing. You feel me? Like against certain people. Uh Overall, I'm proud of myself. I could do more. I didn't do any of my combos. I, I mean, not any. It was a lot of combos and moves that I did not use simply because I I don't know. I wasn't ready to do them. I wasn't confident in them, but we we're training them. Um, when it comes to me versus Swami, I do feel like it could have went either way. I lost by one point. I really thought I won when I was battling her for the simple fact that she was falling out of everything. Um, I didn't do much, but I always felt like it's best to be clean than to be dirty. Um, that's not how it played out for that battle. Um, so, unfortunately, for that battle, it seems like, you know, the, the harder attempts won. She benefited for attempting harder, harder moves, even though... She fell out the mugs, um, but they was fresh. They, they, so they, I mean, I feel like she also won as far as difficulty. Um, but yeah, like I said, like I didn't think that it was the type of prop, the, the type of platform that it was. I felt like crashing would not win, but it did. Oh, no. there you have it. Um, I almost got ran over by her squad. I had to run out the way real quick. It was funny, but yes, I definitely thought I won. I lost by one point. I was very, very upset. Um, but you know, I, I be hiding it well, cause it's, it's nobody's fault. It just be me, you know, I be wanting. When I get so close to the finals, when you get in the finals, you be so close. And it makes me mad when I don't push through enough to actually win and get the dub. I hate that, but I've come a long way and I gotta keep reminding myself of the progress that I've had so that I don't be too overcritical and be too down on myself so because I can do that sometimes you know Virgo vibes Virgo vibes so anyway Korea is actually Red Bull in LA is the next one and after that it's Korea October 21st so I'll be seeing y'all and hopefully next time y'all see me it just only gets better okay all right